right, guys, you're not going to like this, but thank God I took all my videos off of YouTube. As in, they're not public any. They're private. But I can change them one more time. I can change them to unlisted. Now, if I make them unlisted, I can use the links at the Patreon site, okay? Where you have to pay a monthly fee to be able to view the videos. Now, right now I have 442 subs. And if I multiply that by like five bucks a month, that's $2,210. They probably take a cut, Patreon, and probably have to account for taxes at the end of the year. So that's, and then I want to send some money my kids' way because they deserve it like a lot, like most of it. So that doesn't cut it. Now, what number do I like? $7.60. There you go. 3359.2. Okay, let's say they take a cut and they have to count for taxes every month. Brings it down to, let's say, I don't know, 2800 I can easily send at least maybe $800 elsewhere. Not only that, but you can have different levels of subscription. So maybe like 760 could be the base. But if you want access to my live streams where I do like live decodes of like smart math and interacting with people interacting with people hmm maybe that'd be another one okay so maybe if i like had another one for like the live stream videos and then had another one for the new live stream videos so there's the old ones and then the new ones and the new ones could be that you get a like join the live stream with me like audio visually and we can talk about creation code we can talk about your problems with understanding it we can talk about anything but we can further the work necessary to acquire a cellular energy device to improve life for everyone and to improve the understanding like it's basically like going to like college now how much does your university education cost you i don't know 10 grand a year 15 grand a year plus books and dormitory man like what's what's 10 grand divided by 12 833 dollars a month and like i would never ever ask that but you know, maybe a thousand, a hundred, a hundred dollars a month. Maybe I can have like a really extreme primo one. You only have to be like, like if you choose to give a hundred dollars, you could be part of that for the month. It doesn't mean you have to be on that one every month. But you understand that it's like your education. Now, a hundred dollars times twelve is twelve hundred dollars. Twelve hundred dollars for a pretty good education might be very good. Now, depending on the amount of people that choose to do the hundred dollar version i might have to do like a live stream every day instead of like once or twice a week okay and then, no one creates as fast as i do on youtube no one creates the content that i do on youtube that is for damn sure everyone is bullshit it's all false bullshit they're not looking from the correct point of view right i need to make money in life this is a fact to stay part of the system that everyone else is now th let's say this now let's say like the last video i made discovering the truth <laughs> is not mission impossible morty great video took me a long like not took me a long time last night i watched a bunch of movies it sucks because it takes me a long time to watch videos because i have to pull up my camera every time and i i like i don't take good quality and because i'm here and it's late i have to keep it down so not a lot of the, the levels are good and like i have an slr and i could use an slr to take very good crisp high def stuff and then edit it all on my computer instead of on my phone you know what i'm saying so i can actually put a little bit more effort into to improve the quality of my videos it takes more time costs more money different levels of service patreon i love it but at the same time when i upload a video that i edit that takes me let's like that, that last one last night you know i watched a bunch of stuff i videotaped it all last night I fell asleep. I woke up I woke up today at 1.16 p.m. Of course, right? And then I put it together. What time did I post it at? I posted it at... Yeah, 13.27. Just over two hours of editing to do that. Like, and all the, um, all the whiteboard video that went into that was done on the fly I was, I was going. That wasn't pre-recorded. So if I put more effort into my videos and I make them a little bit better because everyone loves like beautiful videos, right? And I don't really make the most beautiful videos because I use crayons because 28 and 28, right? This is not a bad thing. <laughs> That's the funny part of our backwards, upside down and flipped reality.
you know? Not only that, but I'm giving myself 13s. 13s, 28s. I can go over all that shit again, but I am not, I, I refuse to work for free. So, when I do a video, like say last night, I'll make a 15 minute video that'll go on Patreon. If you have a $5 account, booyah, you can watch it. Let's say. At the same time, I'll be putting up like a 20 or 30 second clip. Like a super cut. Public, on YouTube. With the link to the Patreon account if you want to see the entire thing, yada, yada, yada. So I still will be creating for YouTube. I will be primarily creating for Patreon. However, everything that I've created so far for YouTube will be converted to Patreon. I'm going to have to go through everything. I'm going to have to tag it all, watch it all, choose what I want to add and not add because I have a lot of videos. All the comments are going to be erased, but I mean... I guess I'll have to put comments back onto disabled for all my videos. Because there was a lot of good data in those comments. Fuck it, it's all in the past. I'm just going to transcribe what's in the description of my videos back into Patreon. The ones I want to choose. I'm going to label them properly so they can be more searchable in Patreon. Hopefully you can tag videos there. Mm. But when people want to find something, maybe it'll be easier to find. So, yeah, like, you want to go to school, guys? <laughs> Waste... 10, 15 grand plus living expenses? Or do you want to just pay for living expenses and like 1200 bucks a year to have top quality, hands on, you know? You know what I'm saying? I gotta not let my life crumble. Not only that, but I want to improve the lives of those that I love. I would give them everything if I could. I would. No, I even shaved. I mean, that's why I did it today. Maybe I shaved and it changed. It really felt good to shave. I haven't shaved in a long time. I usually take scissors and I literally like... But uh, I'll shave more maybe. So... Who knows? I'll still probably create for free on YouTube other than these little tiny super edit cuts. But I mean... Now it's time for people to wake up. Okay? And... I don't want to work for free, and I don't think I can collaborate with other people for free and make this work. It's just not going to work, guy. And I don't want someone coming in with a lot of money and then pretending like they own my, like own me. Okay, it has to be done my way. I need to be in full charge. Like I, I need to be in charge of this project, guy. I, like whatever you want to think of that. <laughs> That's like good for you and good for me, because. 28 and 13 is 41, and the plus one of my arm is a bunch of 42s, and that's the answer to everything, guy. And two 42s is what? An 84. And what's an 84, guy? Because you can't make a 9 by 9 until you get the four columns and the eight rows on the right hand of God. But then you need the same thing on the left hand of God to kind of like, you know, flip and sandwich and all that, so... Again, I keep thinking I need to have a rebirth. I need to start over again. I don't want to start over again on YouTube. YouTube sucks. The people here are stupid. I want real people who actually give a fuck. You know? I I think I have a formula now where if I keep the clips under 15 seconds, I don't get copyrighted, which is beautiful. Okay? You know, it sucks. Sometimes I'm a little lazy and I like to put my big, long clips out there. But I can't do that, so I won't. Okay? Um, I want to pay taxes, so... And whatever Patreon takes, whatever Patreon takes, I'm sure. They don't do this for free. Maybe even YouTube will be asking for money soon, right? So, I've been getting weird calls from all over the Americas lately. Don't know why. Las Vegas, New York, California. Why? I don't do business with America. Why am I being called? Oh, I know. I, I, I emailed my phone number to somebody not too long ago. And they still haven't called me back. I'm just sitting here waiting. I guess their life is really hard right now. Probably is, you know. They're running away somewhere else. So, you know. Reality is I won't be... I'm not going to be reunited with my kids anytime soon. Because the people in this reality don't have faith in me or something. Or they think I'm not well. When I think everyone in this reality is not well. And that's the truth. So... 
putting my name, my face, my reputation on the line. I'm not a faceless YouTube creator like most out there that claim to talk truth. And I'm not a shit piece of ass fuck like Richie from Boston or ODD Reality or whatever channel or these egomaniac fucking sell earth people or the egomaniac flat earth people they're both right but they're like one ninth right each and their egos are too large to like have them think anything else because you know so and so is god apparently no everyone is god and you're the only guy here and i'm the only guy here and my bubble and your bubble are mutually exclusive it is a symbiotic relationship we need each other all of us and one day we'll become one and sell your energy might or may may or may or may not happen and you know if it does happen great you know what if it doesn't happen <laughs> I get like martyred for this great I don't care I have no fear people with fear I don't need that anymore. there's one guy there's the only person other creator I can think of is Bill from Occult Sciences the OCS 101 that guy doesn't give a fuck and he has no fear but it's hard to bring up this with somebody else because they just don't want to listen and they're right in their minds right all the time everyone is the other creators on YouTube that I've mentioned in the past they all have ignored me so fuck them right Right, John? Fuck him. So, yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna see what happens. I'm gonna give it a, a, an actual try. I'm... I understand how it works now. I have... I don't like the internet and stuff. I'm not an internet guy. I should have figured this out a long time ago. I've been looking at what people make, man. If you go look, like, research this. Go, like, top Patreon. Top Patreon. All top creators on Patreon. Look at this guy. There's a guy here. Chapo Trap House. He makes 94 grand a month, guy. What does he do? Oh, just upside down pentagram comics. Anyway. And like, AVE's here. And he's cool. He doesn't show how much he's making, but like, you know. Like, all he asks for is, like, $2 reward or a $5 reward. Okay? And then you got people like Philip DeFranco, who's asking, like, crazy shit. You know, he's not kind of giving you a degree in anything. But, like, look, there's a $5 or more, there's a $10 or more, there's a $35, there's a $100, there's even a $500 one. There's even a $1,000, guy. But he's all about selling shit and mailing stuff and getting presents. I looked at him on YouTube once or twice before, and it kind of made me vomit in my mouth. So, yeah, like, if I'm going to do something this kind of different than everyone else, like this guy, last podcast on the left, he makes 29 grand a month, or she, this guy, he is not a, a dollar or more per month, five dollars, Satan's little helpers, oh my god, guy, what the fuck, MK Ultra Kids Club? He's got 830 people going 10 bucks. Really? So I don't know what my Hollow Earth, Hollow Earthling gang. Hollow Earth is interesting. 35, 28. Look at this. Wow. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do my research. I have a lot of data. That's the beautiful thing. And I, I'm gonna go after people that post my shit that from the past on YouTube. All that shit's gonna get removed. Like, you're not posting my videos. Okay. Uh, it was this guy. What's his name? Project Frequency. Yeah, he, uh, I got, he's blocked, I think, on my channel, but he chose to post one of my old videos, and he talked shit about me. One video, he's got one video, and with three views, and look, look at this guy. It's my old video, and he wrote this. The Zodiac was deciphered using gematria of the Bible by Kevin Janik. Untrue. Since Kevin Janik cannot currently accept love and hate as polarities of the one and refuses to provide invaluable information... I will have to share his best content for the world to see. See? So, I'll deal with these fuckers later. But, uh, yeah, food for thought. That's it for my content on this. The next movie's going on Patreon.